The message on the 32nd night started with a distinction between two types of fullness. Brother Theodore explained that there is an infilling that we receive according to our capacity and which enables us to manifest God's life. But there is a measure of the fullness that God gives according to his calling on our lives. And to receive that fullness, you need to settle your consecration to the satisfaction of God and enlarge your vision. The leader compared the Holy Spirit as springs of water to which you come to drink. He urged the brethren to drink large, and he led the saints to pray that there will be multitudes in our community who will experience outpouring of the Holy Spirit, like Brother Zach, like John G. Lake, so that we have ministries of great girth. He further led the saints to pray that we will believe this vision that he has given us and that it will lay hold on us because the problem is unbelief and satisfaction with the little accomplished due to comparison. Brother Theodore pursued by calling the brethren to pray that God will create or intensify in us the desire and hunger for God and for the infilling with the Holy Spirit. He explained that desire and hunger is more constraining than sanctification. The problem, he said, is that we have not been charmed. There is nothing that has charmed us enough to keep us away from sin and disobedience. Next, the leader carried the saints to pray that we will be delivered from this pagan fear of not qualifying in our sanctification. What God wants is the truth deep in our hearts. Indeed, the only qualification for the Holy Spirit is that we feel the need for him. And even this desire for him, he still gives us. Praise the Lord. He further led the saints to pray that multitudes will be filled even before the last day of the fast. Lastly, Brother Theodore led the community to pray that on the 24th of November 2023, God will rend the heavens upon Christian Missionary Fellowship International and visit us with great outpourings of the Holy Spirit in power. Because God indeed has days of appointments with communities. Those who will be filled before this great appointment day are just first fruits. But God has an appointment with Christian Missionary Fellowship International from Kume to the ends of the earth on that great day. Que le Dieu du ciel visite le son peuple dans la communauté missionnaire chrétienne internationale avec des grandes étudiants du Saint-Esprit dans la présence. Prions ensemble. Let your 
Even that one, 